So welcome to another segment of Capsule of Hope, dear friend. In our previous discussion, we looked at breaking point, hard time, challenging moment from Christian perspective. We concluded by saying that a difficult moment, challenging moment, breaking point in the life of a Christian is a defining moment. Defining moment because it is a time where as a Christian, your faith is tested. Where as a Christian, you wake up to the reality of life. It's also a time for a Christian to love God, to trust God. Difficult moment actually teach us how to be humble. So today's segment will be looking at how Joseph actually handled broken point, challenging moment, difficult moment in his life. Basically, Joseph happened to be one of the 12 tribes of Israel. His father was Jacob and his wife Rachel. Joseph basically means God will add. Joseph was the favorite son of his father Jacob. This is well captured in Genesis chapter 37 verse 3. There it is captured that his father gave him well decorated tunic. Joseph was sold by his brother to Egypt, where he ultimately became a ruler, second only to King Pharaoh. Dear friend, looking at the world at the time, and also the fact that he was the favorite son of the father, we could deduce that he was a very optimistic person and a boy full of dreams. The question, did he fulfill his purpose in life? Yes, he did, but how? Dear friend, like any of us, he experienced ups and downs in life. Just take a look at his life swings. Promise to the pit, palace to the prison, preference to the punishment, prominence to personal gain, and then purpose. Uh, it was such a zigzag movement. And I have assignment for you. So you to I have assignment for you. You to take a pen and a paper try to analyze your life after that try to draw your own swings of life so dear friend looking at the various stages of life joseph had been through it is reasonable to deduce that there were time in his life where he asked the question why me but he didn't dwell so much on that scripture always talks about Joseph who said I will trust God. I guess his guiding principle at the time was all odds are against me but God is for me. Dear friend, my question for you is after you have analyzed your life what is your guiding principle? Remember that of Joseph is the odds are against me but God is for me indeed if God is for us who can be against us as Saint Paul says who can separate us from the love of God may nothing separate us from the love of God join us for another segment of Capsule of Hope next Wednesday dear friend as we analyze the various stages in the life of Joseph and how he handled these stages. Till we meet again, continue trusting in God. God bless you.